Hello everyone, I'm Freaky and welcome to the video. Guys, TikTok has gotta go. Like seriously, it really needs to go. And there are loads of reasons as to why TikTok has to go. And it's for good reasons. Considering all the research and all the videos that I've watched about TikTok, TikTok is evil and it needs to be banned worldwide. It's destroying our youth and it originates from a country that's trying to take over the world. And yes, I'm talking about China, which is a communist country. Now, I know what some people are going to say. They're going to say, Oh, come on, Freaky. How is TikTok ruining a generation? How can short videos destroy a generation? Well, listen, there are loads of other videos that will tell you better than I could ever could. So, I want you guys to go onto YouTube and type in why TikTok is awful or why TikTok is bad or why TikTok is destroying a generation. There are loads of videos saying why TikTok is awful. And that's not the reason why I made this video. I'm not here to tell you guys why TikTok is awful and why TikTok is destroying a generation. I'm not here to talk about that, but I'll give you a short list. Number one, it's made by China. And it's been said that downloading the TikTok app onto your phone is sending all the data you have on your phone all the way back to China. So your photos, your passwords, your texts, all your stuff on your phone, all your data is being sent over to China. So that's number one. We need to ban TikTok for security reasons. And if you guys don't believe me of what I'm saying, then look at India. They actually banned the app. Yeah, they actually banned TikTok. And I think Pakistan tried to ban the app. There was Indonesia and Bangladesh. But I think they actually might have unbanned it. Hell, the United States actually attempted to ban TikTok when Donald Trump was in office. But Trump didn't get the chance to do that. And when Joe Biden became president, he just threw it out the window. And then sometime later, even Joe Biden went back and said, mm, maybe we should try and ban TikTok. And you know what? I'm all for the UK government to ban TikTok. And if that's not enough reason to delete your TikTok or ban TikTok altogether, then here's some more reasons. Number two, it's destroying our use attention span. Now, I can't put this into words on how serious this is. So I want you guys to go onto YouTube, which you're already on, and type in TikTok is destroying a generation. A video by Upper Echelon Gamers. And another video made by the YouTuber Moon. Well, actually, he's got about, I don't know, about four or five videos on TikTok. So he'll be the perfect person to check out as to why TikTok is evil. But I'll leave a link in the description box below to those videos. I might actually make a playlist of videos for you to go and check out as to why TikTok is evil. So yeah, I'll leave a link in the description box below to those videos. But like I said, it is a very serious issue when it comes to TikTok destroying the attention span of youths. And not just use, but everybody. But like I said, I can't put it into words. So I implore you, I desperately want you to go and check out those videos that I just mentioned. And I'm not half assing this. I really do see the urgentness when it came to the parts where TikTok is destroying your attention span. And I feel bad that I can't tell you guys exactly why it's urgent and why it's destroying your attention span. But like I said, it's very, very urgent, which is why I'm telling you guys to go and check out these other videos. That explains it a lot better than I could ever could. It is urgent that you guys go and watch those videos. And no, it's not because I'm lazy or, oh, I can't be bothered. I just don't know how to put it into words. And again, I just feel bad on not knowing how to explain it. Let's just say it's just ruining your mental health. I'll say it one more time. I beg you guys to go and check out those videos that I've put in the description box below of this video. Those videos will explain everything so again please please go and check out those videos okay and number three is immoral acts on tiktok now there has been a lot of people dancing specifically kids dancing and shaking their asses around and these are kids that haven't even left school yet and there's been other immoral stuff on these tiktok videos and you know what i'm pretty goddamn sure that pedophiles are loving this and not just that other immoral stuff number four brainwashing now you've seen these leftists and these liberal teachers telling people oh transitioning is good and oh being gay is good and right wingers are bad it's all thanks to libs of tiktok who has brought these videos to light and showing the public what these leftists and these teachers and so on and so on is doing to kids number five people virtuing being a victim either they're they're a minority or they're virtuing that oh oh i have a mental illness, I've got anxiety, I've got Tourette's, I've got ADHD, and so on and so on. Yeah, these people are actually celebrating that, oh, they're a victim, or, oh, I have this mental illness. 
like I said earlier in the video, there are videos out there that goes into more detail as to what these people on TikTok are doing. So please go and check them out. There's censorship. If TikTok doesn't like what you're saying, they will ban you. I mean, yeah, some social medias do that. But we're talking about TikTok, yeah? Okay, I'm just going to get straight to the point. Yes, TikTok is bad for you. Like, really, really bad for you. And if you can't take my word for it, again, I'll leave links in the description box below to videos that will explain why. So, the question is, what can we do to combat TikTok? And this is where the meat of the video comes in. I'm going to tell you guys how we can beat TikTok. Or at the very least, slow it down. And these are all my ideas on how we can do it. But if you guys have any ideas on how we can take down TikTok, please let me know in the comments section below. And so, let's get right to my ideas. And idea one is, do a petition and get as many signatures as you can and take it to your government and tell them that you want TikTok banned. Now, this is the obvious one and the most logical one. This is something that should be done right away, but you need to convince people as to why you want TikTok banned. So, the more people know about the problems with TikTok, the more people are going to sign up and say, okay, we want TikTok banned. So the more people who knows about the problems, the more likely TikTok will be banned. So this is what you guys should do. Tell your family, tell your friends, put up posters, post it on your social medias, like Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Getter, Gab, Parler, Tumblr, literally everywhere on your social medias. Again, tell your friends, your family, put up posters and show them the evidence. Like those videos I told you about the more people know, the more chance that it'll be banned in your country. So again, get the word out, tell people why it's evil, and get people to write their names on a petition. The more people demand, the more likely we'll get banned when we tell governments that we want TikTok banned. So yeah, that's all of them. Tell your friends, tell your family, tell your co-workers, tell everybody on your social medias, like, again, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and all your other social medias, and show them why TikTok needs to be banned, and then start a petition. The more information spread about the dangers of TikTok, the more likely people want it banned. And then boom, people will write down their name saying that, oh, we want TikTok banned on these petitions. And then once you've got enough petitions, boom, send it off to the government and tell them, listen, we want TikTok banned. And all these other people who signed this petition said that they want TikTok banned as well. So please ban TikTok from the country. So yeah, that's number one. And yeah, it's a really big one and the best one. So please go and do that. And could somebody start a petition, particularly in the UK and everywhere else? So yeah, well that's then done. Let's move on to the next one. And the next one is, which is an obvious one again, deleting the app yourself on your phone and on your kids' phones and warn everybody else and tell them to delete the app on their phones and their kids' phones. And that would be an obvious one and show them the evidence why they need to delete TikTok. So it'll be from word to ear. And hopefully this will get people to sign a petition if enough people heard about it. I mean, considering that pedophiles are looking at kids who is singing and dancing, trust me, if you're a concerning parent, you know that this will get the parents concerned, both of what it's doing to your brain and pedophiles watching your kids singing and dancing. So that'll be more than enough to get the parents to go, okay, give me your phone, I'm deleting TikTok and don't you ever go on it ever again. And concerning parents will tell other concerning parents, it will be a big massive dominoes effect when it comes to parents looking out for their kids, when it comes to the effects and dangers of TikTok. So yeah, warn the parents, and other parents will warn other parents. Big massive domino effect. And so, that's number two. Let's move on to number three. Now, when it came to number one and number two, you're basically getting the government involved, and you're telling parents, family and friends, and parents about the dangers of TikTok. And anybody can do these things that I just mentioned. But, to those of you who is watching me right now, what can you viewers, or YouTubers, or content creators do to combat TikTok? Well, to content creators who wants to help take down TikTok, let me give you an example of what you can do. Let's just say, for example, that you got yourself a YouTube channel, like, for example, Danger Dolan. Now, if you know who Danger Dolan is, he's got himself a fair few channels with loads of videos, loads of views, that sort of thing. And also, he himself has a TikTok account. And this is exactly what every single YouTuber or content creator should do. And that is to start a TikTok account and put some of your videos onto TikTok. Now, some of you are probably thinking, um, Freaky, how would this help? Isn't the old point of going against TikTok is just to delete your account? Why would you want content creators to put videos onto TikTok? That's going against the old point of trying to beat TikTok. Wait, wait, wait. I do have an idea. Just hear me out. I said some of your videos onto TikTok. I'm not saying put every single video that you've ever made onto TikTok, but I'm going to answer this question with a question. Let's just say, for example, that you're a card collector or a model collector 
like for example Pokemon and you want to collect every single model or every single card of every single Pokemon you would want to get yourself every single card or every single model of Pokemon because you love them so much and you want more and more and more of these cards or models and then you're told there's going to be an expo or a convention that says oh they're going to be selling more Pokemon cards or they're going to be selling more models of Pokemon and being the Pokemon card and model collector that you are you would want to go to that place meeting other people that likes the same thing as you talking to people having a good time and trading and collecting the cards and models that you need for your collection that would be the place that you'd want to go and that's the same sort of strategy that we need content creators can do the same with their videos so let's just say for example that you're danger dolan you got yourself a youtube channel and you got yourself a tiktok channel now let's just say for example that all your videos are on your youtube channel and then you only put up a few videos up on your tiktok channel like say i don't know um one or two every month on tiktok and at the end of that video or at the beginning you can tell your viewers if you like my content please go to my youtube channel i have a lot more videos on my youtube channel and this will entice people to leave tiktok and come back to youtube and watch your stuff on youtube and if you're a content creator and you like this idea you could make a video and upload it to youtube and say why tiktok is a bad place and why you should delete the tiktok apps on your phone and on your computer and obviously you don't tell people that you've got a TikTok and say, oh, I've got a TikTok, go and follow me over there. You only do that on your TikTok videos and tell your followers on TikTok to follow you on YouTube. And even if it's only a few, that to me is a good idea. And with that said, let's move on to the next idea. And the next idea is putting red pill moments from series, movies and games onto TikTok. Now listen, I hate TikTok as much as the next guy. It's an extremely evil force and it must be destroyed. But there is two ways to utilize TikTok. Number one, entice people to come to your YouTube channel by putting a few videos onto TikTok and say, hey, if you want more of my videos, I'm on YouTube, like I said in my last segment. Or there's the second idea, putting red pill moments from series, movies, games, etc. etc. And this is what I use my TikTok for. I put red pill moments onto my TikTok account. Like, let me give you guys an example of a red pill moment. There's this moment on Family Guy where Cleveland tells everybody that he shot his own son and everybody left. And Peter says, wait, what, where'd everybody go? And then Cleveland says, you want to make the media go away? Just mention black and black crime. And that's what I mean by a red pill moment. It's basically telling facts through animations, series, movies, games, that sort of stuff. It's basically the opposite of woke, AKA the blue pill. And that's what I did with my TikTok. If I ever come across something that's a red pill, I would upload it to TikTok. And hopefully I'll be able to red pill a few people on there. Yeah, of course, this isn't going to get the app banned anytime soon. But the very least I can do is to make use of TikTok in a more positive way by red pilling people. And to be honest, I think we need people on TikTok and those people can upload videos saying that why TikTok is bad. Like the videos on YouTube and they could be like around 10 minutes long or under. And you can use all the tags that are popular at the moment. So that way, the more people are exposed to your videos, the more likely you can red pill them or educate them on why TikTok is evil or educate them and or educate them in different ways. Again, red pilling them, showing the evils of TikTok or actual history. And what I mean by actual history is, well, you know how the left has been pushing this narrative that, oh, the white man came into Africa and they kidnapped all the natives and put them onto a ship and sailed them across the seas and made them slaves. Well, this isn't true. Slavery was actually going on for hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years before the white man came along in Africa. In fact, it was a thriving business in Africa. It was other black Africans kidnapping other black Africans and selling them off to other black Africans and Muslim slash Arabians. White people wasn't doing any kidnapping. In fact, black Africans and Arabs was kidnapping white people from coastal towns. Yeah, but you didn't know that. And that's exactly what I mean. We need to tell people exactly what happened that doesn't have a left wing bias. So that way, more and more people will see the evils of TikTok and be red pulled and be educated of what really happened in history. So yeah, that's another one. Let's move on to the next one. Now, there is going to be some resistance when it comes to people saying, okay, you cannot go on TikTok anymore, either from adults or parents or the government if they ever ban it. And yeah, there is going to be some resistance to this. But if they want to make videos, where would you tell them to go? And obviously it would be YouTube. If they want to make videos, they can make videos on YouTube instead of using TikTok. Hell, they can even use YouTube Shorts. It's similar to TikTok, but much better. So yeah, if they want to make videos, tell them to upload it to YouTube or YouTube Shorts. 
And with that said, let's move on to the next one. Now, what else could you do to fight against TikTok? Well, let me ask you guys something. Have you guys ever heard of Libs of TikTok that's on Twitter? Well, basically, there's this user called Libs of TikTok. And basically what she does is that she gets as many clips or videos off of TikTok and she exposes of what people are doing and saying on TikTok. She basically reposts them onto Twitter or she puts them in a compilation video, which is basically putting all sorts of videos together and uploading them to all different places like Rumble. So yeah, if you're on Rumble, please go and subscribe to her. Anyways, she also exposes the left-wing teachers on TikTok. And I'm telling you, these teachers are absolutely insane from what I've seen from her reposts and compilations. And it's all thanks to Libs with TikTok for exposing these people. You know, LGBTQ teachers saying that, oh, I'm gay and I'm trans. And one or two of these teachers are trying to convince kids that they're gay. I saw this in a video. Now, you can say that it's all thanks to TikTok that all this was exposed to the world of what these left-wing LGBTQ teachers are doing in our schools. And you know what? This isn't what I'm talking about. I am really, really glad that Libs with TikTok is actually exposing all these leftist teachers. And that's exactly what I mean. We need to have more people exposing all this horrible stuff that's on TikTok. I mean, Libs with TikTok is actually doing it in a positive way. Like, oh, look what they're saying on TikTok. I mean, what she's doing is absolutely superb. I mean, I've got no complaints there. So at least one good thing came out of TikTok. You have idiot leftists exposing themselves to the world saying that, oh, I'm LGBT and I'm trans. I mean, all these leftist teachers aren't even teaching them anything. They are actually brainwashing kids. So yeah, there is a positive to TikTok. You have idiots exposing themselves to the world saying that, oh, capitalism is wrong, I'm gay, and so on and so on. And again, it's all thanks to Libs with TikTok that exposed the left on what these teachers are doing. That's the good thing. But we need to show the negative stuff of what TikTok is doing or what's on TikTok. And there has been a few more people out there that has exposed all the terrible stuff that's on TikTok but we need more people to do more. We need to show people the immoral, depraved stuff that's on TikTok. You know, kids dancing around in short pants and vests. There's people virtue signaling saying, that, oh, I have a mental illness. I have Tourette's. You have people on there that's actually brainwashing children or brainwashing people in general from saying, oh, this person is racist because he's a Republican or, oh, men are oppressing women and all sorts of stuff. We need to get those sort of videos and more and repost them to other places like Twitter, Gab, Minds, or download them and make a compilation of them and show all these videos to the world and show the sort of people and show the immoral stuff that's on TikTok. We need to do exactly what Libs of TikTok has done. Download all these videos or repost them to all different places and tell people, hey everybody, this is what your kids are watching or oh, this is what your kids are doing on TikTok. There are people who are virtue signaling their mental illness. There are people on TikTok who is brainwashing everybody. And if people want evidence, just show them the compilation of the videos that you've downloaded from TikTok and upload them somewhere else or show them where you've repost them. And once people have saw all this false stuff that's on TikTok, people will repost it on other social medias and show their families. It will spread like wildfire. It's like Libs of TikTok. She was just reposting videos of teachers brainwashing kids and teaching them about LGBTQ and teaching them that, oh, Republicans are racist and so on and so on. And that's exactly what we need. We need more people to repost all these videos of all the immoral depravities and brainwashing that TikTok is doing. And multiple people can do this. Hell, get the police involved if you have to. Considering what I've heard on what kids are doing on that app, well, let's just say they are dancing inappropriate on TikTok and they have loads of followers, either from perverts or other kids their age who think, wow, look at him or her dance and look how many people are following this person. I want to be exactly like this person. And TikTok is a bad influence on our kids and that is why it needs to be deleted from our phones and it needs to be banned. We need to do everything in our power to have this app banned. And if you guys have any other ideas on how we can get TikTok banned, please let me know in the comments section below. Now listen, these are my ideas on what we could do on how we can try and get TikTok banned. If libs of TikTok can expose or what teachers are doing to our kids in schools, pushing their LGBTQ and leftist ideals onto kids, then we can show adults and parents all the negative stuff that TikTok is doing to our kids. And like I said, you can show people videos that people have made on TikTok. I don't mean, oh, show people that's on TikTok. I'm saying show people what's on YouTube that people have made about TikTok like what you can see on the screen now and show them all the depraved immoral deviant stuff that's on TikTok and hopefully 
the word will spread about the bad stuff that's on TikTok to a point the parents will say, okay, you're not going to be using TikTok anymore because of all the negative effects that it does to you. And moreover, adults, parents can go to their local government, build a case around why TikTok should be banned and demand that TikTok be banned from the countries that we live in. If India can do it, then we can do it too. We need to do this for our kids' own good, even if it means there's going to be backlash from our kids. And if they want to make videos, they can make videos on YouTube with none of this immoral, depraved stuff they do on TikTok. I mean, do you guys really want kids to think, wow, this 14-year-old girl who's the same age as me is just dancing and she's got like millions of followers. I want to be exactly like her. Do you guys really want people to brainwash our kids on TikTok and saying all this stuff like it's no big deal? Do you really want China to have all your data? Do you want predators to watch your daughter dance? Do you want your kids' attention span and mental wellness to be destroyed? Then speak up about it. Tell other people of what I said. Show them evidence by making them watch these videos I told you about. Show them all the depravities that's on TikTok. Get your local government to try and ban TikTok. And hopefully one day we might actually save future generations and hopefully this generation too. So what do you guys think? Am I right? Am I wrong? Do you hate TikTok? Is there any other ideas on how we can defeat TikTok? Please let me know in the comments section below and let's get a discussion going. I'm Freaky. Peace out. And please don't forget to check out my other social medias. Please go and check out my alternative video platforms. Rumble, Odyssey, BitChute, Twitch and please come and hang out on my Discord server. We can play games, have a movie night or a series night or you can watch me play a few games. And if you guys have any suggestions of any videos you want me to react to, or any video ideas in general, you can tell me on my Discord. I'm also on Twitter, Gab, Getter, and Paula. I'm on Locals, Tumblr, Minds, and if you guys want to support me, please go and check out my subscribe star. It's like Patreon, but better. All these things are in the description box below, so please go and check them out and subscribe to them. I'm Geek Freak. peace out.